Colombia will take on Messi and Argentina in the Copa America final. That was the scene last night as Colombia beat Uruguay 1-0 at Bank of America Stadium. Colombia faces Argentina for the championship Sunday in Miami. But there's some more video people are talking about this morning. Right after the match, players from the Uruguayan team climbed into the stands at Bank of America Stadium. And you can see them in the video fighting with Colombian fans, throwing drinks and punches. Security officers moving in to try and break up that brawl, which took more than 10 minutes to get under control. Conmebol released a statement after the game saying it strongly condemns any act of violence that affects the game. Well, now the focus turns to the weekend games, including another one that's going to be here in Charlotte. Mary Calkins is live outside the stadium with more. Mary? Well, Naya, fans, they were out here in the streets outside Bank of America Stadium for hours celebrating Columbia's win. Now, crews, they are still inside. They are cleaning up as they have just a few days to prepare for the next match happening on Saturday. Now, for the fans who didn't attend the game, they were packing bars in Uptown. The party actually starting well before the match. Thousands of people crammed the streets of the French Quarter just blocks away from where the action was centered. The focus of the soccer world on Charlotte, City Council member Malcolm Graham said event Events like Copa mean lots of benefits for the Queen City. It's um, very exciting to be here in Charlotte and, and really to now know that we are on the international stage related to sports. The hotels are filled, the restaurants are filled, the bars are filled. Uh, obviously, we're expecting a huge economic impact. Now the next match is happening here at Bank of America Stadium on Saturday when Uruguay faces off with Canada for third place. Now right now it's unclear if any of the team members involved in that brawl will be sanctioned, but of course as soon as we find out we will let you know. Reporting live in Uptown Charlotte, Mary Calkins, WBTV on your side.